right, it's 9.45 and I am just uh, leaving the park office area uh, to go over to the Granite Ridge Trail, which is right across the street. See it there? Um, I was just talking to Lynn and Brian. They've been here quite a few times in the winter and they've done the trail as well as my friends Jack and Paula who suggested it. And they said it's really nice. There's some some good views, one of Killarney, and then you get a view of Georgia Bay. So I'm excited to see what this trail is like. Good morning. It is 10 a.m. on Thursday, December 30th, day before New Year's Eve, and I am here in Killarney at the Granite Ridge Trail. I'm going to uh, do a little hike here and check out the scenery. Let's go take a peek. I'm just at the start of the trail, but I already love the feel to it. It's, uh, well, the start of it anyways is really foresty and there's tons and tons and tons and tons of trees here. It's all closed in, I really like that. I guess there's a lot left to see, so. <laughs> Orange fungi. Oh, and some little ones here. Pretty. Oh, now we've got uh, a bit more open and tons and tons of birch trees. So pretty. I love birch trees. The sun is uh, supposed to be out. It's behind the clouds right now. Hopefully it makes an appearance. Good morning, birds. Thought I saw an animal, but it was just a bird flying around. It was low on the ground. Look at these trees, they're so pretty. Oh, there's the sun trying to come out. And as I came around this bend, I noticed that the snow was sparkling. Sometimes when it's really cold, uh, I think it's about, feels like minus 12 this morning. Uh, it's still pretty chilly. The snow is sparkling. I don't know if I can catch it on the video, but I wanted to try. This is so pretty. Look at this beautiful view. Oh, just a little ways in on the trail. Um, there's this car. It's like a car and a trailer, maybe. <laughs> just sitting here in the middle of the forest. So strange. Um, but it's pretty cool looking. Cool. Just like a winter wonderland here. It's beautiful. All right, up we go. Apparently I'm supposed to have a stick with me, but I got my selfie stick, so I'm sure that counts. Reminds me a little bit of the crack. There's like this nice foresty trail going in. It's super flat and pretty. And now <laughs> there's climbing. <laughs> and my quads are like, oh, do you remember what you did yesterday? And my quads are like, yeah, I certainly do. <sighs> Look at how pretty this is. I'm 
So I just pulled up my Avenza map um, because this trail is on it uh, as well as lots of others. There's some really cool tracks here from something. Um, and it said that uh, that car, there's two cars and a mower. I thought it was an axle from a car, but it was a small mower. And they're from one of the first homesteaders here in Killarney. I believe their name was Tyson. And uh, that was really cool. A little bit of ice there. <laughs> okay, onward and upward. Back to a nice trail through some very beautiful old trees. Oh, something just took out. Oh, there's a grouse right there. A very not clear view of the grouse. Trees brush here. That's probably why it's here, because it likes to hide. Hello. There it is. Why my fingers are getting cold. Hello. Come on, turn your head. Get a peek at you. Space and I like just walk into it. Oh, behind the tree now. Come on, here it comes. Come on, a couple more steps. That's it. Yes. What are two pretty things? All right, well, as I've been down there in the forest looking for my grouse, the sun has come out. You can see it just top, touching the tops of the trees here. So hopefully I get a really nice view when I get to the lookout. The train's pretty good. There's just a couple of rocky sections I went through so far. And uh, the rest of it's been pretty, pretty nice. Ooh, hello, sun. Oh, now I got the sun on my face a little bit. And it's sparkling in the snow. It's super pretty. There's nobody here. I think I'm the only one on the trail. Me and the grouse. It's pretty sweet. Some rocks coming up. Maybe there's some nice icicles. I'm gonna be here all day. <laughs> I keep stopping to take pictures of stuff. It's so pretty here. Everything is just so nice. Snow covered and it doesn't look like anybody's been here uh, since since it snowed. It did snow yesterday a little bit, but I'm not sure if it was enough to cover tracks. But uh, I'm almost at the lookout, according to my map. So, 
Hopefully I'll be there soon. Sun's out now too, it's so nice. Every once in a while I get a little warm wave from it. It's just nice. It's not freezing out. It's not super cold, but my hands have been getting cold this morning and um, because I pulled the toboggan out this morning from the campsite, uh, I was sweating. So I'm kind of uh, wet underneath my layers, which was making me really cold. But now that I'm moving around, I'm good. Up, 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 up. You came from down there. <laughs> I'm really excited. I'm almost at the lookout and uh, I got a teeny tiny peek of what I'm gonna see. It's spectacular. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. That's so cool. All right, here we go. All right, <laughs> I think this is the side that you see Georgian Bay. I was told one side you see Georgian Bay and the other side you see Killarney. So. full 360 because it's awesome <laughs> back there you can see Killarney I'm not sure where the lookout is but I'll find it well the sun is out and the view is absolutely stunning there's a bunch of layers of clouds and in the camera they look orange and pinky um, more so in the camera than they do in, in person but it is absolutely amazing up here. Look at this view. I just can't stop looking. I just want to sit here for the day and sit in the sunshine and stare out and <sighs> just breathe. It's so nice. Oh, I had a t hard time leaving that beautiful sunny spot. It was so gorgeous. Um, but I was really curious to see this lookout. And it is very, very beautiful. Oh my goodness, what a view. Wow. This is amazing, look at this. What a gorgeous view. I'm so glad I did this trail. Thank you to everyone who recommended it to me. It's beautiful. Well, now I know why it takes so long to do a two kilometer trail. <laughs> oh, wow. I'm just hanging out up here, enjoying this incredibly beautiful view. It is breathtaking up here. So happy I came. All right, I've been standing still too long though. I'm starting to get chilly, so I'm gonna start making my way back down. All right, I found the split and um, I couldn't tell which way I came from, but uh, I can see my fresh tracks. One trail has them, one trail doesn't, so 
taken the one that doesn't. So hopefully I see some new scenery on my way back out. Wow, I was so lucky. The sun has gone behind the clouds now and it's just barely out. I got that great, great view. A whole bunch of really amazing pictures and videos and, and now it's behind the clouds again. I'm so, so lucky. Totally lucked out again with the timing today. Uh, I can hear a bunch of people over there, probably on the loop in. And I just passed a couple and a dog on this trail going out. So they're all heading up to uh, the top now in the lookouts. And uh, I had them all to myself. So super, super lucky and very, very grateful that I got the time and the uh, opportunity to do that. Glad I got out early today. Aw, yay. I just ran into Gabriella and Jarek. I was so happy to see them because um, yesterday I had mentioned coming to do this trail after the crack. And then, uh, oh, sorry, I got a little tricky part here. There we go. Um, yesterday I mentioned coming here after the crack and then I was just wiped and I said no but I didn't know if they had come or not. And uh, I thought if I didn't see them in the parking lot this morning, I was gonna text and tell them to make sure to do this trail because it's really nice. And I just ran into them. So they let me take a picture. I'll insert it here. And uh, Gabriella and Jarek, it was so nice to meet you guys. Um, yesterday they let me kind of tag along with them on the way out of the crack trail and uh, we were chit-chatting a lot about the outdoors and stuff so really really nice people. Uh, it was a pleasure to meet you guys. I hope our paths cross again one day. Okay I'm in some strange sketchy part of the trail here. <laughs> so uh, I, did, I did see number 13 so I am going the right way. Just have to find the path. <laughs> wow, this is a little crack like, my phone keeps telling me it's got a low battery and I have my portable charger but I don't want to bother taking it out so I'm hoping it just makes it to the end of the trail so I don't have to worry about it. But you have to shut the low power, the low battery notification off on the phone. And uh, I can only do it with my glove off. So, uh, I can't, uh, that was quite the little segue. <laughs> oh wow, look at how steep this is. Oh, there's the trail down there. So I just have to get down this. Um, I think I'm not, oh, let's, let's see how it is. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna film this part. Oh, no, it's actually not too bad. Little bit more tricky than on the way in. Okay, back onto some some type of normal ground here. <laughs> oh, sweet. I have returned back to the little creek, the babbling brook. I'm not sure what you want to call it. It's pretty small. Um, this is where the split is. So when I came. I just went across and went that way, um, but you can also go this way. So now I am back on the same trail that I came in on. Well, it's 11.45 and uh, I'm just uh, back on the trail that I came in on, so 
going to sign off here. Um, this is a really, really, really nice trail. If you've never done the Granite Ridge Trail in Killarney, I highly recommend it. Uh, I think it would be nice in summer, spring, winter, or fall. It's absolutely gorgeous. There's some beautiful views, and uh, it's not a, a huge amount of work to see them. And it's a pretty quick trail uh, compared to the crack. You know, it took almost four hours. I think it was three and a half or three hours yesterday um, to do the crack. So to uh, compare it, much easier trail and you get two spectacular lookouts, one of Georgian Bay and one of the La Close Mountain Range. So really, really, really great trail. I'm glad I did it. And uh, I'm going to sign off for now. I'm looking forward to uh, going home and having some yummy treats, nice hot bath, and spending the day relaxing uh, in, in my house um, after being out in the cold for, for three days, even though it wasn't freezing. Um, it's still always nice to, to go back home after a trip and relax for a bit. So, And I'm going to be working on this video, so hopefully these videos will be out very soon. All right, I'm out of here. Thanks so much for watching. If you like what you saw, please click the subscribe button. Also click the bell for notifications. If you'd like to get more information on the stuff I use on my trips, please check out my website at camperchristina.com. Thanks. Bye.